Hello, I'm Merlin Malili. Welcome to the making of Beth Gate is Dead. I made this album all by myself, totally by myself. This is Alligator. I put up my flag. flag was given to me years ago, probably in exchange for a meal. I used to run free kitchens. So this is my flag. I wave it when I need to. <laughs> yes, I guess I'm a bit of a freak. I wave my freak flag. This is my freak flag. <laughs> I'm Merlin the Lily, but I'm also Beth Gate. Beth Gate is my given name. And, uh, Merlin the Lily is my stage name. I went by EBG Malili for a little while. I was using Evangeline. Beth Gata Malili. Um, Malili is uh, actually um, more my real name than my given name to me. It was a matrilineal name and it went back to, well, it goes back to the time before Christ and um, when my great grandmother came to the United States, they told her she couldn't have a matrilineal name, that she had to take her husband's name. And she had a husband, so she took his name. But Malili was a, supposed to be my name. It, it was supposed to be my. great grandmother's name, and it was supposed to be my grandmother's name, and it was supposed to be my mother's name, and it was supposed to be my name. My past is sort of spotted with a lot of pain, so I decided um, to start using the lily more and um, to uh, leave my past behind. Um, as Beth Gaeta and be more myself by being Marilyn Malili. But Beth Gaeta is a hopeless deadhead and so is Marilyn Malili. We have that in common. <laughs> so I wanted to put together some of the dead songs that I like to sing. So Beth Gaeta's Dead is a play on words in that it's there's an apostrophe before dead so it's in reference to the grateful dead and I'm not dead but the name is we sort of put it to rest <coughs> excuse me so the way I made the album without a looper was I basically came out here to my, what was my studio at the time, which is now my living room, dining room. It pretty much was all those things then, but now I have a studio. <laughs> <clears throat> but I put up this flag over the computer and I would play a track that I we have a pretty decent sound system, so I would play a track that I had already recorded, and then I would record another track over that. So that was how I put drums in. Mainly, I just recorded a, a basic track with vocals and electric guitar.
and then I went back in and put percussion. Um, so I added drums and or organ to different songs, but the song, the original recording of each song was, um, whole, it just didn't have drums or percussion. So now we're on Addicts of My Life. This is all me. I just chose to not be in the picture. <laughs> um, I thought maybe it would appeal to more people if I wasn't in the picture and that they would hear the music rather than look at the person. any of this. This is all off the cuff. It's sort of improvisational. I wanted it to feel fresh. I know all the songs. These are songs I've been singing for years. So I just thought I'd make a fresh go of it on guitar. It worked out in some places and in other places it didn't work out so swell. But I I think overall um, if I liked it, it it worked out and it got uh, left in. So <laughs> that was good. Oh, and I used a, a karaoke machine microphone with no techniques though um there's a little i had a little amp for my electric guitar just one of those little cubes it was effective it's funny i was listening to some grateful dead from 1968 yesterday and uh, it sounded Early Jerry sounded to me like me strumming through Jerry. So um, I'm going to keep strumming through. Maybe I'll get better like he seemed to do. So I used some little bongos and my big drum and I think I put in a little shaker and Dark Star the, is a, actually a pencil and a water bottle with which is shall we go to, to Dark Star let's go to Dark Star and listen to that it's at the very beginning
I just release these myself. So each copy is um, made individually by me. So when you pay for a copy, you're paying for an original piece of artwork that's not only created by the artist, but um, uploaded by the artist, um, and it'll be burned by the artist to, the, to a CD, which will be, you know, encased and, and treasured just for you. It'll, I'll, my first album comes with a hat. Um, there's a... until Jerry died, I went to as many shows as I could get to. I used to um, attend as many shows as I could at Madison Square Garden, and every year that I could get there, and waiting for the second track to come in. Wait for it. It's
used to go up to Giant Stadium every year I could get there in the summertime. Giant Stadium. The first time I was ever fed by um, Hare Krishna's from Free Kitchen um, was at Giant Stadium, a dead show. And I was inspired to move on and feed others. From there, I fed millions of people after that because of that. I didn't realize you could just feed people and how beautiful. So I did that for a long time. I ran around the country feeding people. I busked sometimes dead tunes. Busking is um, playing on the street for money. Um, I used to play on the street for gas and money. Gas was a necessary evil to us at the time. We had a RV and we had a Dodge Ram bus. I wrote a song about it. Um, it's called Beulah. It's on uh, the other album that came out the same day. for me. Really anything can be your studio. But now my studio is sort of purposefully soundproof and um, lit a certain way and Thank you. 
song Ripple. I know this isn't exactly like the Grateful Dead's Ripple, but this is an evolution. same time. So I, I can either do it track by track or um, I can play one or the other or I can, you know, play with other musicians and use a drummer and or a bass player. I can use a bass player though. I sort of have a bass player. Maybe I put out a, 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 a
another album. Um, with another play on, on my name, but on the new name. Cover more dead songs, but call it uh, not like other girls. Because I'm not like other girls. <laughs> Keep listening to the dead. Keep listening to Marlon Malilli. Keep looking for Holy Grail. Keep looking for Marlon Malilli. I'm going to beat it on down the line. Thanks for watching.